Learning all about wine means learning the grapes, the regions, the villages, and the wine production methods as well. And whilst that's difficult enough in itself, actually being able to say some of these things is even more difficult. So today, we're gonna to play the pronunciation game. Hello and welcome to the Grape Explorer where we celebrate the world of wine. On this channel we do wine education, product reviews and lots of tastings. So if you're interested in wine, consider subscribing. So when you're learning all about the different grape varietals and the regions, it's not about learning just about those regions themselves. You have to be able to say them. And it's not just about being able to say them either. That means you need to be able to say things with a French accent, a German accent, perhaps even an Italian accent. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to play the pronunciation game. And when I say uh, I'm going to play the pronunciation game, actually I'm not going to be playing it at all. I've got some willing volunteers who are going to come on camera and play it for themselves. They're going to be picking uh, words out of a bowl from easy through to difficult, and we're going to see how they get on with some of them. So we're going to start off with contestant A. So I'm absolutely delighted to be joined by contestant A, who we shall refer to as Antonio. Now, Antonio does not like oaky wines, but does enjoy a barrel-aged Malbec, so make of that what you will. Uh, Antonio is going to be picking two uh, pieces of paper out of each bowl. These are the easy ones, these are the more difficult ones. So Antonio, <coughs> it's over to you. Okay, so just go straight in with it, shall I? Straight in with it. Great, okay. But this seems to say, Gamay. It actually says Gamay, but that was a pretty good guess. Uh, I'm going to give you half a point for that one. Well Thank done. you, I'll take that. Okay. Okay, so next one from this pot? Next one from that pot as well. Okay. Well, I know this one. Mm -hmm. This is a Syrah. That is Syrah, correct. Well done, one point. So Thank one and you. a half on the easy ones. Thank you. Moving on to bowl two then. Oh, this is a Suave. It's a Suave, Italian grape. <laughs> you look suave if I'm not <laughs> Thank you very much. This is a Pinot Gris. That is a Pinot Gris. But again, good try. I'm not doing very well. Okay. Moving on to bowl three. Great, okay. Okay. This is a Nero de Vola. That is a Nero de Vola, correct. Thank you. Excellent <laughs> pronunciation. Thank you. This is a Sangiovese. Correct. These are Italian. These are indeed. <laughs> on to bowl four. Great. This is a Spätburgunder. This is a Spätburgunder. Okay. A uh, German name for Pinot Noir. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Right, all right. If anyone ever spat Burgundered into my glass, I'd be asking them to take it back. <laughs> okay. Let's try another one, shall we? Okay. Oh, you're getting the good this, ones uh, today. This is a Gewurztraminer. Gewurztraminer. Not pretty good. I'm going to give you right. half a point for that. That, Thank was, you. that was a pretty good effort. Thank you. Last bowl then. Thank These you. These are the difficult These ones. These are going to be awful, aren't they? <laughs> okay. Oh! Yeah. This is a Trocken Bierenhaus. That's actually <laughs> pretty good. That's actually pretty good. Trocken Bierenhauslaser is a okay. German word. One more for you then. Thank you very much. Anyone keeping score? <laughs> no. no, okay. This is a region in Chile. Okay, this okay. is a Aconcagua Valley. Very good. Oh, so right. Antonio, I can't remember what you scored to be perfectly honest as we went through this, but I do think you made an excellent effort. Well done. Thank you very much. Well now I'm absolutely delighted to be joined by contestant B, who we shall refer to as Bush. Uh, Bush <laughs> tells me that they really like Chilean Sauvignon Blanc, although off camera they did actually tell me that if it was wet and white there's a good chance it's going in. So uh, Bush, we are going to start off with bowl number one. Okay, good. <laughs> oh god. Um, Cabernet Sauvignon. Very good, Cabernet Sauvignon. Nice, easy start there. One point. Riesling? Riesling, very good indeed. Two for two from bowl number one. Okay, moving on to bowl number two. You don't get another one out of the easy bowl. <laughs> um, if that's any help. Tempranillo. Tempranillo, close, oh. half a point. Pretty good effort. Got two minutes, Right. Antonio wishes he got Tempranillo, I can tell you that right now. Tre... Trebiano. 
Trebbiano showed with a beautiful Italian <laughs> accent as well. So that was that was special. Of course. Okay, bowl number three. Number three. Okay. Ooh. French grape. Viognier. Viognier. Yeah. Three quarters of a point. <laughs> oh, so very close <laughs> on that particular occasion. Thank you. Mm, welcome. <laughs> Why is it so much harder than yours? Um, the first bit is mm -hmm. Val Polisella. <laughs> it's not, but okay. <laughs> um, Ripasso. Val, Val Policella Ripasso. That's what I said. Well, <laughs> we are on ball four. Okay. As oh, Greek grape. Asiatico. 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 Mm -hmm. One more from bowl four. Uh, this one is... A region in Germany. Rheinhessen. Rheinhessen, perfect. Yes. Nicely said. Last okay. bowl. Good Difficult luck. Bowl. Difficult Thank bowl. You. You're welcome. I need it. Ooh. Um, Italian. Montepulciano de Bruzzo. That's a pretty good effort, I think, for that one. <laughs> Monte Polciano da Bruzzo. Da Bruzzo. Very nice indeed. One more then for Bush. Good game, thank good you. Good game, you're welcome. <laughs> Don't suck up to the judge. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh, it's got a thing on the A. Yeesh. Hungarian. Saga Muscatali. I'm going to give five eighths of a point there. I believe it's Saga <laughs> Muscatali. Oh, okay. Well done, Bush. Thank Excellent you. Excellent effort, well done. Well, this is our final contestant. This is contestant C, who we will refer to as Schnookums. Uh, you may have noticed we've run out of wine. We've had to move on to beer, but that's absolutely fine. There are no beers in the pots though, sorry to say. Okay. Um, Schnookums likes red wine. She enjoys Syrah, she enjoys Carmenere, and she puts ice cubes in white wine. So take that how you want to as well. Yep. Let's be a little nice. bit judgy here. Okay, you ready? Yeah. We're yep. gonna start with bowl one then. Good bowl luck. One. These are the last, last ones to pronounce. I don't even know how to pronounce this. Barolo? Barolo, <laughs> yep. Last one out of bowl one then. So, I don't have one. Does that mean I get an extra point? Who took an extra one out of bowl one? So that means I get you two get points a buy on for bowl one. Buy on bowl one. Okay, Right, cool. bowl two. Okay. Oh, Grenache. Grenache, correct, very nice. Yay. Two great, points. Great. Well, one. Oh. Nebbiolo? Correct, Nebbiolo, <laughs> which makes Barolo. So, interestingly, ah. you've um, playing pairs as well, it would seem. Interesting. Okay, on to bowl three. I feel like maybe I did get off a bit lightly. Yeah, then. I think you did, like I say. Mm. Okay. Or maybe not. Okay. Gruner mm -hmm. Vetlina. Gruner Vetlina. Very oh. good. Do I get half a point? You get half a point. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Blau Frankish. Blau Frankish. Very good. Oh. Yeah. Okay. A point. Yeah. Yeah. This is uh, this is going a lot better than I expected. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I'm really glad I went last. Yeah. Uh, you know. Ball four. Okay. Hmm. Ribera del Duro. Ribera del Duero. Mm. Okay. Three quarters of a point. Okay, thank you. Good effort. It's all about the effort. It is all about the effort. A for effort. Yeah. Uh, French grape. Sinso. Sinso. Oh, Close okay. though, but no cigar. It's the tea. It is the tea, it puts you off. Okay. Not too bad. Okay. Last bowl. Good luck. <laughs> oh, it's like schnookums. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> it's really not. <laughs> no. This is a region in Germany. Schlossbockleim. Schlossbockelheim. They have all oh. the best words. That's what I think. Schlossbockelheim. Schlossbockelheim, okay. yeah. And the last one. Here we okay. go. Drum roll, please. <laughs> is this Greek? Yes, it is. Okay. Agiogitiko? No, nope. Ayo, maybe. It's Ayoitiko. Yeah, Ayoitiko. Well, we don't say yes that. after I've said it, that's not the idea at all. The idea is that you say it and then I say that's correct. Yeah. yeah. I Be kind easy. of knew it was going to be a Y. 
sound. Okay, yeah. I failed. So there we go. Good effort, contestancy. Well done, Schnookums. Thank, Thank you for joining. I think all of that goes to show that some of these things are incredibly difficult to say, but they can be learned. But now it's over to you. Let me know in the comments section below which are the particular wine phrases that you found difficult through your studies or some that you actually still can't even say today. I'm the Grape Explorer. I look forward to seeing you again soon. Cheers.